What? It's like day 20 of quarantine. Let's start the show. Folks, hello and welcome to a spicy, well, hot, no, child-friendly episode of The Pink Lemonade Menagerie, the only show where I just realized if I turn my uh, phone around, I have a way better camera. Now, today's guest is somebody very special, very near and dear to the heart, Nikki Knockout as Mermaid Nikki. Now, Nikki runs their own entertainment company. Uh, you've seen them perform Lyra. You've seen them once shoot me in the throat with the arrow. We'll talk about that later. And on occasion, Nikki becomes a mermaid, and she reads stories to children in libraries. It's adorable. I highly appreciate her doing this for us. Check it out. Hi, everybody. It's Mermaid Nikki. How are you? I'm here to bring you Mermaid Story Time, and today we're going to learn all about sharks. This is called If Sharks Disappeared. Look at all those sharks. If Sharks Disappeared by Lily Williams. This is a healthy ocean. It's a balanced environment where many different animals and plants thrive. The ocean is a home to a lot of creatures. Big, small, tiny, cute, and dot, dot, dot. Sharks have helped keep our oceans balanced for about 450 million years. Over that time, they evolved into more than 400 different species that exist today. Sharks are apex predators, which means they are at the top of the food chain in their ecosystem, the ocean. Losing an apex predator species can cause devastating effects in the environment. Ooh. That's the food chain. Today, roughly between one-fourth and one-third of shark species are vulnerable to extinction because of overfishing. What could happen if this continues and sharks disappear altogether? If sharks disappeared... Dot, dot, dot. The ocean would no longer be balanced. Although different species have different diets, most sharks typically eat sick, slow, or weak prey, leaving the healthy animals to reproduce. If sharks disappeared, the population of seals, sea lions, and other pinnipeds would potentially explode. At higher populations, they would eat more and more fish, and eventually, once there weren't any fish left, they'd starve and die out as well. If fish and pinnipeds disappeared, plankton, which is what many fish that are lower on the food chain eat, quickly grow out of control. They could make the ocean a thick sludge. Nothing could survive in this water. If the ocean became unlivable, many species of land animals that rely on ocean for food, such as seabirds and polar bears, would starve and die out. The loss of these animals could cause still more species farther inland to die out. The pattern of cause and effects, called by trophic cascade, could spread like a wave across countries and continents until animals around the globe were affected, from bees to birds to bears, and eventually to us. All right, folks, that's all the time we have for now. Tune in next week for the second half of the story and to find out what would happen if sharks disappeared forever. Aww. 
That was adorable. That's something you put on the background while you just live your life and make you feel better. Now, if you enjoy that, we'll have links to Nikki's social media. We'll have also have links to their Venmo if you want to leave something special. It's a hard time for us all. Uh, now, I do just want to say, folks, I know it's getting rough out there. Uh, I find myself struggling to produce these sometimes, struggling to make them. I know the whole team is having uh, trouble with that. I'm assuming everybody is. So I just want you to know it's okay to not do anything. I personally didn't do anything before this. I've seen all 10 Children of the Corn movies. What? Yeah, there's 10 Children of the Corn movies. Wrong! There's 11! So one called Silence of the Crow from 1983. Yes, Sven, I brought it up in the show. You better leave this in. Better leave this in. Better leave this in. Children of the Corn! Oh, folks, well, thanks for joining us for another Pink Lemonade Menagerie. Stay tuned. We'll see you soon. This is the 13th episode, and that's... That's... That's, that's something that... We, we, we did this. Thanks.